So what exactly is PCOS and how did it affect you during your fat loss journey? So actually about three months into us working out, I felt like, and you felt like we weren't having the results that we thought that we should. So you altered it a few times to see, you know, all bodies are different. All hormones balances in people's bodies are different. We were both trying to figure out what was going on. And I actually ended up going to the doctors where I got my blood work drawn and my testosterone was actually through the roof, which is not great for a female. I should have way more female hormones than male and my female hormones I wasn't producing enough of so telltale sign that you have PCOS and then with further testing at my other doctors they ended up diagnosing me so you asked how it affected my journey I would say after the diagnoses we both did research on it you did your own separate research I did mine consulted with my doctor and I felt like we figured out from there okay so I'm not someone that should do high intensity workouts because that shoots up my cortisol levels and my cortisol levels are already very high that's not good for me personally with my PCOS. So we had to switch that out. And once we found low intensity, still our heavyweight training, but just low intensity as far as cardio goes and stuff like that. I think after that, we I started really like shedding the weight.